Chinese Honda. Looking at this 2000-ish Honda Accord with the H23 engine in it, the ULEV motor. There are many different types of Hondas with different emission setup. So make sure you find the right video. Check out my library if this is the right course. Here's the underhood label, match it up with what we're looking at. And also, if you need any of the parts shown in this video, make sure you check for a link in the description to find the parts if you need them. First, we're going to start off with the EGR valve right here on top. Super easy to see, super easy to get to and replace right there in the circle. Don't forget to like while we're watching this. Right here on top as well is the EVAP emissions vapor purge solenoid. Super easy, everything. It's a Honda. Check out skieshobbies.com while you're at it too. Right here on this vehicle is your bank one sensor, one oxygen sensor. Might be an air fuel ratio sensor on your vehicle. Also right here on top, we have the PCV valve, positive crankcase ventilation valve. This is a normal maintenance uh, part that should be replaced, say every about 50,000 miles especially when it's so easy to get to and replace, such as this one. 50,000 might be excessive, but a little better. There's a vacuum switching valve on the firewall right there. But as of no importance, let's go to look under the car. You're gonna have the rear oxygen sensor right here in the catalytic converter. Light on it, so you can see it right there. This will be the oxygen sensor that measures the efficiency of the catalytic converter. That's it. So if you have an air fuel ratio problem, this oxygen sensor is not one to replace in that situation, but it is one if you have a P0420 or such, something like that. The EVAP vapor canister is right here under the rear door on the driver's side. You're going to have the canister itself. And if you look really hard, you will find the vapor vent solenoid as well with this little connection right where the arrow is pointing. Hopefully this helps you in your DIY project. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share. I'll check you. I'll see you on the next hopefully helpful video.